वेलकम एवरी वन माई सेल्फ प्रोफेसर के वी कुशारे इन मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग डिपार्टमेंट फ्रॉम राजश्री शाहू महाराज पॉलिटेक्निक नासिक टूडेज लेक्चर वी डिस्कस द वॉट इज द फंक्शन ऑफ मैनेजमेंट मैनेजमेंट फंक्शंस और ड्यूटीज आर रोडली क्लासीफाई इंटू इन द फॉलोइंग कैटेगरीज द कैटेगरीज फर्स्ट वन इज planning function of management first one is planning second one is organizing then directing controlling motivating then coordinating and last one is the decision making this is the seven functions of a management we discuss a one by one function of the manager okay first function first function is a planning planning is decide in a advance what to do how to do and when to do who will do and where to do that is mean by the planning deciding and planning is essential for utilizing all available resource in the best way to achieve goal to develop and establish the enterprises it is a process by which a manager anticipate the future and discover the alternative to get the work done then he is decided how best to achieve the goal profit applying best category in any organization in in any organization the manager is given decide to how best to achieve goals profit and applying best strategy like a planning is a most important function of management that success of the project or work depend on a quality of planning that is depend on a quality of planning as a defined set of step to do the particular activity or activities in a systematic manner that is means my quality of planning the base of success of any project or any organization or goal of any organization it's a planning the best is the plan the best result are produced the planning is a very important because remaining all function of management are strictly depend on the planning activity the bad planning throw any organization out of the market it is a very important points of organization strictly dependent on the planning activity but they bad planning throw an organization out of the market then without proper planning the activity of will be become confuse and ineffective this is the process of planning how to establish a process of planning in any organization or any manager to determine the situation relating goals assess risks create plans implementation plan review and revise plan <laughs> the objective of good plans the object of good plan there is this is the process but there are some point of organization level first we need to achieve the departmental as well organization goal then to create the feasible work schedule and complete the work without the time limit the third one is to utilize the resource in a proper way to by minimize the wastage then budget of or the different project or work then the proper delegation of the work then allocating rights and responsibility of any organization to increase the team work spirit then next one is the achieve the optimization and to work with the standard of organization that is the points of organization level then advantage what is advantage of planning a complete guideline about how when and what work has to be done in any organization planning helps in a completing goals of organization delay in work can be avoided plan ensure minimization of work risks uncertainly in a work generally no emergency occurs in work because of pla- good planning then next one is a good work can be done if e- effectively then standardization can be enforced throughout the plans help in a determining the future problem 
this is the advantage of the planning some point has given we discuss on this point then next is a what is the observer that planning generally get fails because of the planning reasons they are given some points the first point is incomplete knowledge of work absence of data analysis then nature of plan absence of feedback of plan then not considering risks uncertainty then the improper delegation authority and responsibility is the very important point on the observer that planning generally gets there are there are some plans types of plans could be broadly details or summarize plan depending on information present in the first one is the plans are first one is a operational plan tactical plan strategic plan or contingency plan the we discuss first point what is mean the operational plan operational plan decide how thing must be happen there must be guideline of how mission has to be accomplished then third one is describe the day to day activity in any organization they are online plan the next one is its involved policies for addressing problems rules regulation on procedure for accomplishing particular objective if they means op- operational plan says in any organization we take the some policies or addressing problems rules regulation and procedure for the accomplishing particular objective that is a important point on operational plans the second one is the the tactical plans tactical plan tells about what is going to happen there could be many plans that are focused short terms and specific tactical plans support strategic plans its scope can be of year or less time then third one is strategic plan which strategic plan is all about why thing must happen then b is strategic planning is done to see the big picture along with the long term thinking means it's give a overview of all overall business this planning is done for long term that is mean a strategic plan contingency planning means the planning is done when unexpected situation arrive any suppose any accident that the next is this is a term as special type of planning contingency planning is useful when the change occurs this planning situation based that is the contingency planning there we discuss the what is meant by planning this advantage uh, then objective and operational planning statistical planning strategic planning and contingency planning there some importance importance points there some importance points of planning we taken one by one and discuss one by one the first is the planning is any important activity because it is a foundation of any work or project planning gives resource estimation that gives any ideas what is and how much that is the planning on time project that the completion because of possible only because proper planning that is the given some step of planning and why need planning to be done after the following step very first very first is to develop the objective for the which planning has to be done suppose any organization the organization is manufacturing any pistons rings the main target and main objective we will be develop on any organization then second one is next step is the develop the task to accomplish or meet those objective third one is in the third step required resource should be found out from the implementation stack okay the these steps involve tracking assignments of method using which tasks will be do that is a step but next in, in this step factor like risks involve or certainly and potential failure are analyzed then rechecking for the ready plan is done plan is finalized plan will be distributed to the people who are involved in the process that is mean that is the planning okay we we discuss the what is the mean by planning what is the function of management then types of planning operational tactical strategic and contingency then the what is the importance points and step of planning we discuss and understand 
द वॉट इज मीनिंग ऑफ प्लैनिंग इन एनी ऑर्गनाइजेशन ओके थैंक यू सो मच